think Diddy Kong around the pressure that Enki can deliver. But I don't know how well Enki is equipped for fighting Diddy Kong. It's a very unpopular character in Ultimate. Uh, typically regarded around the bottom 20 until very recently where a lot of people saw that he's got the he's got the sauce. Not a lot of the sauce, but he's got the sauce. He's got enough. He, not just enough of the sauce. Uh, we'll see if it's enough to keep JDV alive against Enki. Uh, winner of this moves on to fight Tweak in winner's quarters. So this will be a fun match. All right, so, so this is... Here we yeah. go. Starting off here. Enki's starting to try to lay on this damage. Doesn't get too much, though. You're going to see a good amount of that throughout this set. A lot of hit and run. Yeah. However, I feel like Pikachu's combos are a bit more potent. But JDV is going to find himself in more situations, especially if he has banana in mm. Yeah, so um, JDV trying to, you know, get some type of exchange here going, trying to put his shit as advantage, but he hasn't gotten any. Right now, there's just been a lot of scrambles and a lot of disadvantage for JDV to try and get out of. You're going to see a lot of the scrambling and the, the little bits of uh, control that Inky does have. They're going to be fleeting. So it's not that bad of a situation for JDV. Mm. Goes high on that recovery, just barely getting over the forward smash. You know, Pikachu's the type of character, you know, to... Oh! I like That's it, not going to take it, but that enough. was a nice, uh, nice mix-up there on his shield, the dash back forward smash. Pikachu has the speed and reach to definitely, like, get schmixy with his pressure. Yeah. And it's something that I've noticed out of Inky's play that he's very comfortable with. Yeah, and the, the last set we saw him in, yeah, he was definitely doing a lot of that fade back in the F smash, trying to force you to approach and just being able to catch you. Mm. He's not going to take the stock, though. I think that's going to be a big thing in this matchup, is that Pikachu's going to have a lot of trouble getting that kill. And uh, JDV, while down in damage, is going to catch up pretty fast, as you're seeing here. He's definitely uh dash attack. Oh, that, yeah, that it, yeah. dash attack's gonna be a good catch, and Inky is uh, gonna go up a stock. And he's right, gonna just get some damage up. up air into the nair. All right, he's got the banana now. Oh, that was Ooh. a nice dash back to the banana throw to get some damage up. JDV at 69% right now. Let's have scenario, and he's not gonna get anything. But JDV is being pressured on the other side of the stage. Off stage now. He's going to air dodge through that thunder, but now Enki is off stage. Let's see if JDV can make something of this. All right. Uh, the down tilt's not going to get back on, goes for the up smash, doesn't get it. And that's something Enki's been doing very well. He's just laying on this damage, this stock, but he gets back thrown there by JVD. And, and that's going to uh, take the stock. All right, so that banana isn't going to lead into anything. That's sad. I see that's uh, Diddy Kong still struggling in that sense. Yeah, the banana doesn't allow you for too many follow-ups, but it does allow you to reset the situation. Mm. Uh, one thing that's worth noting is that when the banana is in the air, you get the trip, but it's not, uh, it doesn't disappear. So it's not nearly as powerful for the types of, uh, of pressure that it can exert, but it's useful enough, especially if you're creative. Keeping it in hand is just so good for Diddy Kong. It gives you all the setups that you need to put on a lot of damage, set up for kills, extend your plays. Yeah, I noticed that JDV is getting a lot of use from it uh, as a way to cover himself in the air, as an anti-air on Pikachu when he first uh, releases it. That way he can, you know, hold, hold and shield, and if uh, Anki jumps at him, he's not, Anki's gonna get hit by the banana. Turns out those Thunder Jolts, really smart there. If he catches him, he's able to force him to recover again. And Diddy's got a charge at recovery. Yeah, even with the buffs, that's still something that Diddy Kong really can't afford to do. Oh, oh no! That was. But he's gonna. Oh he's not no! Gonna that. Yeah. All right. So now I'm noticing Thunder Jolt is gonna be really good at covering those low, uh, those low recoveries by JDV. Yeah, he's basically with the Thunder Jolt. He's able to force him to recover a very specific way. Yep. And, and not one that JDV wants to recover. No, in. yeah. Like usually when your opponent like forces him to recover a specific way, it's never the way you want to go. You want to be able to have as many options available to you as possible at all times. That's always the preferable way to play. But uh, Inky doing a phenomenal job at making that lin uh, recovery more linear just by throwing out that hitbox and saying, you can't go here. Mm. All Ooh, right. Drop shield He's going to catch there. him with the final hit of the forward smash. And now we're at about an even game. JDV, though, down 60%. Oh, just comes in with the barrels. Yeah, he's not going to make anything of that. Now he's Crazy. down 75, but he might have a chance to build something here. 
but he's not catching it, uh, Enki with anything. And JDV is off stage. Not a good scenario for him. He's out of the ledge trap. All right, let's see what he can make of this. All right, some big damage coming in. Nothing too much. All right, gets these down tilts. All right, using that down B there to just clear the ledge. Back on, gets some drag down there, gets some up airs. Playing on more damage, putting in a more reliable area to kill him, and the throw. That is that going to kill, and Enki is going to take the first game. It was decently close. I mean, obviously, en uh, Enki was uh, ahead the entire time, but JDV held his ground. He was bringing it back, and he just, you know, he couldn't. He no, couldn't yeah, catch up. Yeah, JVD fell down pretty, uh, a pretty decent amount on that first uh, second stock there in percent wise, but he managed to bring it back and make the a close, close call there at the end. Mm. Uh, still could have gone either way, but not in the way JVD wanted it to go. There we go. Moving into game number two. Let's see where JVD wants to go. And we're going to go to town. He's going to make the run back. I definitely think this would be good for him. I'm sure this might have been his pick originally. I don't know who picked the stage, but I would imagine if he's going back to it, that's the stage he wants to go to. Yeah. Um, it was very close, and I think JDV can definitely take this game, if not the set. All right, so here we go into game number two. Inky up a game. All right, so we'll see if uh, JVD is able to adapt to... Uh, oh, that was a nice uh, nice read on the get-up attack. Makes the small... Uh, he's going to foxtrot in with the forward smash, and the forward smash is going to make him uh, back up a bit. He's going to profile away from it. Guess that monkey flip there. Just comes it in. Seems like Pikachu has a little bit of trouble with that monkey flip. He's just throwing out this monkey flip. Yeah, I think he realized something. <laughs> I'm back in the jungles, boys. Inky cannot handle the monkey flip. Alright, gets this drag down there. Doesn't get anything off of it. Alright, but he's off stage and this is problematic, but. I think he's not going to make anything out of it. Back to neutral. Ooh. He's going to get him with the barrels this time. He's in the air at 115%. My man is out here just trying to kill him with barrels. Jeez. Oh, right, that is not going to get him. Gonna gonna enough, no. All right. This isn't comes in with the barrels. <laughs> he's going to catch goodness. him off guard. He's going to take the stock. My he's now up. Goodness. He's, uh, Inky is now down a stock. And GDV. Wow, that's yep. bad DI. That's a very powerful move. In combination with that DI not being perfect. Well, now Inky's oh. sort of taking his lead yep. with these loops. Oh, big damage! Oh, he's gonna get spot the tech dodges. spot dodge twice. Yo, yeah, just make sure. I don't, I don't want to be grabbed. Just making sure. <laughs> making sure he's not gonna hit at all. I come down, tries to catch him going high, but he he purposely snaps the Alex. I guess those jabs. Ooh. So, right. I mean, Inky's Inky just doing a good job at catching JDD going in when he shouldn't be. Nice and he's there, punishing that. Off stage, but he manages to regain stage control JVD. And, ooh, just monkey flips right into that forward smash. Still not enough. Ooh, comes in with the barrels, though. Almost takes it with the barrels. Things are about even right now. JDV probably wants to take the stock right now to keep any sense I mean, of a lead. Both of them want to try to take the stock. They're both in kill range. Mm. All right, this throw is He's not going to do enough. anything, right. but he's now in an edge guard situation. Uh, and the barrels again get him. But Monkey flipping barrels. That's all you need these, to win this match. These barrels right are here. just the, the bane of Inky's <laughs> existence right now. Like, All right, I guess that. That's yeah. a nice turnaround fo uh, up smash to punish the monkey flip. And now they're about even, but Inky can uh, build some big damage here and uh, oh, the push barrels this Disney. again. Good he's Lord. been hit by like eight barrels this game. JDV catching Inky, pressing the barrels buttons. The barrels are the MVP of JVD's game plan right now. All right, gets this grab. Oh, doesn't get the fair. All right. Ooh! Expected the roll in, didn't get it. He's just teasing him with these F smashes. He's letting him know. He's letting him know who he is. Big damage right now on JDV. All right, all right. he backed far away from those barrels. He's like, I'm not going to get hit by that. Yeah, he's not losing this lead Ooh. right now. He wants to take Try it to get here the and now. Up, but he got the tech. Oh. That's a nice read on the monkey flip. All right, he's got him off stage. Okay, he's JVD's back. got to start mixing stuff up if he wants to make right. this comeback. JVD and managing to clear off, getting himself off the ledge. It's very important. Oh, gets the monkey flip. 
Oh, oh! Wow, that was Clean. nice. And Inky with another 2-0. And he is going to move on to the win his quarters. Walk. To fight Tweak.